issuing a new technology to uh, do something they call precision policing. WSCV's Eden Hodges speaks to police about how this helps them find suspects easier and this is much quicker than ever before. You know, sometimes cases turn on something that simple. As simple as a snapshot of someone leaving the scene of a crime. For us, that's a piece of evidence that we could potentially use after a crime occurs in that specific area. Statesboro police are using flock highway cameras to find suspects based on their license plates. We're trying to use technology in a way to make ourselves more efficient and more effective uh, without intruding on people's civil liberties. Before, if they had a report about a stolen white sedan, they'd have to check every white sedan they saw. Now, Police Chief Mike Broadhead says they can police with surgical precision. Sometimes from that eyewitness, you're just looking for that clue, right? Like, just give us an idea of the description of the vehicle. Well, this is a step beyond that, right? Because it's not just a description of the vehicle, it's the license plate and a photograph to make sure that that vehicle matches that plate. When there's a stolen plate that zooms by, police are alerted. Broadhead says they've even been able to recover seven stolen vehicles and get a clue into a couple homicide cases. Juries, I think, want to see video evidence of things. And to the lack of people willing to be eyewitnesses, uh, this is really just a step we need to do to fill in that gap. In addition, they have Raven sensors that can detect and report where gunshots happen before anyone has started to dial 911. When they hear the specific decibel level of a gunshot, they will triangulate that from different sensors and immediately give us feedback as to where a shot was just fired. Broadhead hopes that with the tech boost, their officers will be able to do their jobs accurately while still in record time.